how's everybody doing today? Hope you're doing good. Boom, boom, boom. You know, this is surprisingly not that bad of a game, you know? I was not expecting to have fun with this unless I had a bunch of people come in. Why is this guy invisible? Hold on. How did- Oh! Oh! Ah. Where we dropping in, boys? Is that a dead meme by now? I feel like it is. No one's gonna... No one's gonna take the lead? I don't know anything about this place. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Well, there's my people over here, so... It works, I guess. I guess I'm gonna hang out with, uh... Liz... 1217, because I think they're the closest. Actually, them and Priceless are kinda alright. But, you know, we, we're just gonna hang out, float a little, head towards whoever's marker this is. Everyone seems to be going towards it. Someone took the lead. It wasn't me, of course. I don't know what the fuck we're doing. But you know what? Last time I got the Victory Royale, I went in on this little tower. I don't know if it was the same tower. Was it? Yeah, it was the same tower. Is someone down there already? I'm gonna try and end their life. Did I get them? No, they're already gone. Haha, <laughs> I'm not shit. Okay. Well, cool story. It worked better in my head, and we've got a rifle, so, you know. How main, mine? How are you already down? You're as bad as I am. So, I guess main is dead. Liz is... Way the fuck out there. I don't think Liz knows what they're doing. Like, I'm pretty dumb in this game. But, like, I at least know to go towards the circle. And they're like as far as the cir uh, from the circle as you can get right now. Liz, I'm sorry, you're you're done. If you make it, you a boss. I'm out in the open. I don't have very much. I don't have any slurp slurps. What up? Hey, I don't know what that means. Seriously, like, Liz said fuck it all. This is all I really care for. You can get whatever you need, but you saved my life. It was a team effort, though. Got a shoddy. Not, but, not, stop. That's what I was saying where my uh, controller is. Busted. 
Is Liz actually in? Holy shit! Yeah, see, I'm not... All I'm doing is moving forward, and it's, like, being fucking weird. Liz came in clutch! Where's... Oh, no, they had plenty of time. I'm just over-exaggerative. scrolls that would be called a wipe someone had a turret was it me did I have that turret okay I got an SMG and bullets and so far no one is red on me oh yeah oh yeah cool 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 let me get one of these. And with that, you can be quickly back with your team. Silent Spectre. Is this our trap? I hope so. If not, I will be stuck in here. Forever. Someone is shooting. There's a whole lot of shits going on. He got the headshot. I, I literally set it up so he can get a headshot. I'm actually really excited to have had the opportunity to do this. Uh, it's not as big as I was hoping. Maybe I have to work on networking and, you know, getting the word out more. We'll definitely do more of these for sure. Because community is what grows, you know? Um... Uh, but like I said at the very beginning of the stream, I feel like crap. My back had been hurting for, I don't know, two months or so. And then last Wednesday, right before Thanksgiving, of course, like, just a sharp knife was just repeatedly stabbed in my lower back all of a sudden. Like, I had been good for two weeks or so. And then out of nowhere, just... I walked up some stairs and I it was like a hot bloody knife it was just yeah 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 I could I could barely walk went to the chiropractor which was uh, I don't want to say a mistake cuz like it did help me feel better for a little while but they were like oh your hips like misaligned and uh, we're going to get that realigned I don't know if that was true, I think that was, like, they didn't take any x-rays to be sure. And that's, that's annoying. That's kind of, that makes me lose a little bit of faith, but, you know, I didn't go to school for any of this. Oh, well, I have my EMT stuff, so I know a little bit. But they were saying, like, my tendon connecting my pelvis to, uh, my spine was, like, inflamed and I was, like, crooked and such. So I was like, all right, well, I'll do this and take care of business and live my life, I guess. Friday, I went into work, feeling at least 80% good. But I was like, listen, if we have an issue, I work in a psych hospital. If we have to do, like, restraints or anything like that, uh, 
I don't know what that is. But uh, if we have to do like restraints or anything like that, we're just gonna have to call a code and like have everyone come. I won't be able to deal with it on my own or like with our small group. Of course, we had a patient act up and they pretty much attacked me and I ended up on my back. I wanted to cry. Like, my back was in so much pain every time I took a step. And so finally I was like, all right, listen, as soon as second shift gets here, I'm cutting out, I'm going to the hospital, I'm getting this checked out. I really hope I don't have like permanent damage to my back or anything. And uh, we get there, or I get there, it takes like five hours. Get some x-rays done. I have bruising on my spine, which could very well be from any other incident, really. And, uh, the doctor was like, yeah, you can't work for the weekend. Alright, cool. But, turns out that I have kidney stones. Yeah. And that's likely what has been hurting the entirety of my back, is kidney stones. So I've been trying to flush my system ever since then. I did have plans on Friday night to, you know, get turnt. And when I make plans, I try my best never to bail on them. And so what did I do? I went out and had me a good old time. And did my plan work? To an extent, you know, I drank that pain away. 100%. Like, I didn't feel any sort of pain anymore. But at first, whenever uh, I first started drinking, it was horrible. Let me get away from you guys. Cool. I call basement. Bitch! Dibs. But yeah, uh, kidney stones felt horrible. Thought I was dying all weekend. Or, for the night. Where was I? Drank quite a bit. And whenever I first started drinking, <laughs> I didn't quite expect it to happen, but I felt my kidneys. Like, I never thought I could feel my kidneys before. I felt them that this time. It was, I felt the entirety of the liquid moving through my kidneys and filtering through. It was not fun. So, what do I do? I just drink more. Like, <laughs> eventually I'm gonna become so drunk, I won't feel it. And it worked. I stopped feeling it. And at least on Saturday, and most of Sunday, my kidneys were good, I didn't feel anything. Today they're aching a little bit. I've been drinking quite a bit of water though. Hopefully the stones pass, and it goes away soon. And that's my life. Who's breaking shit up there? Okay. Oh! Hey, yeah, get over here. Keep coming, boy! What's going on? Fuck me. Oh no. Please stop. We got fucking jumped. We did alright though. I got a kill. I think I got a kill. Did it count as a kill? Let's see, what are some other stories? So, growing up, Throughout high school, me and my friends loved going on adventures. We would literally find anything and everything to do. Because here in this small town of Kentucky... Okay, I guess, I guess, uh, we're good. That's fine. 
In this small town of Kentucky, literally, growing up, the only thing that there is to do is underage drinking, which I never did, by the way. I'm awesome. Um, or drugs. Like, I never did that either, by the way. But, you know, there weren't too many options for kids around here. And what little options that there were, they were like extremely religious, like pushing it down your throat and, you know, teenagers don't want that usually. Like, we just want to enjoy a good time and like be stimulated in some way. And there's nothing around here for that. So what we would do was find shit to get into ourselves. Something called Urban Spelunking is something that we learned pretty early. We mixed it with parkour. Uh, we would, you know, climb to the top of all the abandoned buildings. We have been in every single abandoned building in our small town. We've been on top of every single abandoned building. It's just what we had to do. We never got it, like... If cops ever stopped us, we just explained to them, like, this is what we're doing. We're not breaking anything. We're not, like, we never broke into anywhere. Like, the doors were all unlocked. It was all unsecured. Probably completely dangerous, but, uh... No one told us not to do it. So, even the cops were like, well, you guys should go home. Be, care be more careful. That, that's pretty much like they're getting on to us and there are so many people I am not going here I don't know where my team is there's one way over there like we're all split up I don't like being split up for my team we're supposed to work together guys fuck that Oh, fucking shit. Yes. Oh, oh, it is on, guys. I don't know if he was, like, wanting that, but it is mine now. Okay. I don't want to waste the turret. But I also don't want to not use it. So I think what I'm going to do is sneaky snoo my way to this building right here. Hopefully I don't die from this. We're going to get the high ground, basically. Do you guys hear anybody? I don't hear anybody. I like this uh, layout. It's very bright and colorful. All right. People can sneak up on us over there. All right, where, where are they? Oh, we're going to use this. How do I use it? Where are you guys? Where is everybody? Did I waste this? Can I pick it back up? I hear somebody. Is that my teammate though?
fight with the... Only you can prevent... Okay, that's cool. <laughs> I'm alright with that loss. I'm very purple right now. But, uh... <laughs> Are we stuck? 